I was looking at the Turner family tree and Turner buildings in Cape Leadham. I just came across this little plaque about a tree to a very famous soldier in his day, Tom Brown. So it's just a little short video about that. You can find out a lot more about his exploits on the on the internet. When the almshouses in the school opposite were built, and the Turner Estate was being completely remodelled. Here were several of the ancient villages' houses which were in a, a pretty dilapidated state. Probably had thatched roofs and uh, wattle and daub walls, cold and damp places. And one stood on this spot. It was lived in by the blacksmith. Mr. Brown and his son Tom Brown he was the hero of the Battle of Dettingen in 1743 it was one of the battles in the, one of these wars you never hear of the war of the Austrian succession and he suffered appalling injuries of course and was particularly of his face and he, he ended up with a, a silver nose which was presented to him by George II and uh, when he returned, he, uh, he he went to live in the Elm. You can find a lot more about him on the internet. But this big elm tree was planted on the site of his house. That's the accepted rumour. The tree was planted in 1755. And it looks to me there that it's, I would think it's a hundred years old. So this photograph was certainly probably taken in the late 1800s. The 1880s, 1890s. And it was still there, or the remains of it were still there in 1960. But it's since been replaced by an oak tree with a little plaque alongside it. Tom Brown, this famous soldier, was born at Kirk Leadham on the ho in a house which supposedly stood on this site just outside the arms houses. This was the original elm tree planted uh, on the site, allegedly. I used to travel past it every day going to school there and back. I, I had the faintest idea what it was about. All I knew was this decrepit tree standing outside the arms house. So Quite surprised they didn't get rid of it. Anyway, they eventually did. <laughs> and they planted an oak tree and put a little plaque there. Although the little plaque doesn't seem to be looked after very well. I had to go and clean it myself. So they, there you can see the oak tree. Planted to replace the elm. And brown. So, uh, last time I came, this was filthy, so I've just cleaned it up. I've just come down this time and cleaned it up. This fella, Tom Brown, I told you about him there, I won't repeat it. When I was a kid, the elm tree was still here, although it, it, it had fallen down at some time, so there was just a stump with uh, branches growing out the side. It's obviously been uh, removed, and this oak tree has been planted here in its place. And down the high street at Yarm, on a building on the right hand side as you're going towards the river crossing. There's a little bit more information about this chap called Tom Brown. I think that was where he died. <laughs>